Hello and welcome to Brightpoint Infotech, your trusted Microsoft Dynamics ERP Gold Certified Partner and Microsoft Solutions Partner. Today in this video, we will introduce one of the reports in Brightpoint Power BI Report Showcase, which is the HR Management Dashboard. Through the video, we will be giving a closer look into the reports and explain the features and benefits this report offers to both the end users and the organization. Firstly, the HR Management Dashboard. The HR Management Dashboard is a BI solution that empowers you to make informed decisions, identify trends, track key performance indicators, etc. This report can be leveraged by an HR manager or a team lead or even an executive to get insights and actionable analytics as it provides a holistic view of your organization's human resources. Now let us dive into the reports. This is the home page of the HR dashboard. It is from here we will be going into each of the reports that we can see on the top. Here there are buttons provided for each report and clicking the button will take you to the respective report. Let us go into the first report. This is the interview insights report and it provides a summary of interviews taken based on performance outcomes like whether the outcome is happy, neutral or unhappy. With this report, the user gains insights into the interview processes and outcome of the candidate's performances. It helps to assess the effectiveness of your interview process and make informed decisions to improve the candidate selection and hiring outcomes. Let us take a look at a visual or two. Here is a visual which shows the outcome of interviews conducted in the batches interview 1 and 2. Like how many of those interviews performances outcome was in happy, unhappy or neutral. On the right there is a visual that shows the number of interviews that were conducted for certain positions each month. On the left there are key metrics like total interviews, total consultations etc. And these are the slicer or filters using which the user can filter or slice the data as they need. And also the user can click on a visual to filter the other visuals according to that selection. So here if the user wants to see the data for interview batch number 1, then upon clicking the interview 1, the other visuals will also show the data for that particular selection. This is the interviewer insights report. This report gives us information from the opposite perspective. That is a summary of interview performance from an interviewer's point of view. And the interviewer wise performance outcome and their impact on the hiring process as well. It helps in identifying the top performing interviewers and enhance the consistency and quality of the interviews. On the right, we have a meter gauge visual which shows the number of interviews with happy, neutral and un unhappy as the outcome out of all the interviews conducted. And on the left, this graph shows the performance outcomes by the interviewers. This graph gives a picture of the quality of the interviewers. Moving on to the next report. Here is the employee performance report which gives a summary of employee performance and gives a picture of the hours spent by the employees. This report helps in making informed decisions to improve employee engagement, keeping a track on productivity and career development. On the left, there is a breakdown of the hours spent by the employees, showing billable and non-billable hours. And on the career development side, there is a visual in the middle which shows the certifications done by the employees. And the last among these reports is the onboarding and offboarding report. This report gives a summary of onboarding and offboardings of employees. With this report, the users can get a picture of the general metrics of employees that have joined and the employees that have left. And also a picture of employee attrition which indicates a need to implement strategies to enhance the employee retention and satisfaction. The table visual below shows the monthly employee attrition and the attrition percentage every month on the right side. On the top, the visual shows the number of employees that have joined per month and the same way for the employees who have left the organization. 
With the date slices on the left, the users can view the data for the year and the month of their choice. That's all about the HR management dashboard. Thank you for watching and hope you have found the video insightful and valuable. For any further information or questions, do not hesitate to reach out to us. We appreciate your support and looking forward to seeing you on the next video. Until then, take care and have a wonderful day. Thank you.